tonight, we'll be hearing from uh, Stefan, who's uh, head of data strategy at Aviva Quantum, Freddie, who is Shell Digital Project Manager for New Energies and Emerging Markets, and Helen Crooks, who's Chief Data Officer at Lloyds of London. The Quantum team that sits here in the garage um, over 18 months is now 35 strong. Across that mix, we've got 12 different nationalities. When we arrived as a data science team, um, the analogy we used it was a bit like a school disco. So we were all stood on that side, the data science team. They were stood over there. And over the last 18 months, we've kind of had to come together and we're not quite there yet, but we've definitely moved into the middle of the floor. So first off, who are we as a team at Shell? Well, we're the digital center of excellence. We've got the product management team. We've got our engineering team, where some of our amazing Kubrick's um, analysts are working and engineers are working too. We've got a computational science team. We've got our emerging digital technologies team. That's a really fun team to be in. And then we've got the digital excellence team. The way we think about data in particular is we, we've got three lenses on it. The first lens is how can we improve or optimize a current process? The second lens is really how do we generate a new value stream, a new additional piece of revenue, additional piece of margin, an OPEX saving. And then the third, quite understandably, is how do we create new commercial models using our data. When I started the Data Lab, I wanted to start with something that would actually make sense from a market and from a corporation perspective. And as we go more global, as the landscape becomes more complex, we have more and more regulatory information to process and we have more difficult and complex regulatory questions to actually answer. The thing for me is really crucial is the people. We have used Kubrick to develop out our, uh, our data science uh, capability and we're looking and working with Kubik on the data governance models as well and it's so important to actually get new people and new thought processes into our into the company.